Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Check it out. Look what came in the mail. So, you already know we're going to be checking this out. Um, the Yu Nagaba uh, Evolution kind of collab finally came in. I ordered this a little bit ago. Um, super excited. Kind of... So I've decided that I didn't want to open this. Um, since there's no cards in it, let's go ahead and take a look. I just wanted to show the artwork on the box, which is so pretty, so cool. Um, but if we take a look at what's actually in the box, so we have uh, a 64 count of sleeves. Um, there is a deck box. Oh, it's really not cooperating there, huh? Um, and then obviously it counts the, the whole container or, uh, you know, this whole piece as like a display box. And then there's a, a cool mat, um, which I'm starting to become obsessed with collecting neat play mats. So, um, what I'm going to end up doing is I'm going to put this back there. It's going to be a display item with all the other amazing cards back there. Uh, the shelves don't look that cool, but when I get that third shelf built, it'll, uh, it might look a little more magnificent. I'll, I'll move the table and stuff. It's a work in progress. Don't worry about that. But, um, <clears throat> yeah, so just wanted to show really cool box. Uh, you don't really get any packs. Well, so technically if you were to order this, you would have gotten some packs from the Pokemon Center. And uh, I got this, uh, not sponsored in any way, but I got this from EXP Share um, or ES Collectibles, I think is what they actually go by. So what they did, which was really cool, they, they didn't have to do this. I'm just going to, oops, let's not mess everything up. Um, so what they did is they actually included the packs that would have came with the order. Um, and that, that's really cool. It's cool that they did that. They didn't have to do that. Uh, so because it would have been about, uh, 40 ish dollars, um, I think you would have gotten packs per $10, I think. Is that how that would have worked? But, uh, really cool little, like, holographic tape here. Um, I'm assuming that was done by the Pokemon Center. I think. But, um... Maybe not. I don't know. This is... Is that from the game? The Academy? Okay, anyways. Let's open these. We're gonna see what, uh, Evolution promos we get out of these. Uh, they're all... They all seem pretty expensive right now. I think Umbreon's going for, like, 25 bucks or something like that. Um, really cool box. Sorry, I'm not opening it, but, uh, you know, if I get another one, I'll open it, but I don't know. I'm trying to get better about when I get cool stuff, actually making a video and opening it, because I'll end up getting cool stuff or new release, you know, items, and then I'll just sit on it because of work or time or whatever, so um, this is my attempt at, uh, even though I'm not going to open it, I'm sorry, uh, but we're going to open these at least, which are cool, um, and... And, uh, you know, it, we'll, we'll still we'll still check some stuff out. We'll still make sure that we get, like, a nice little 15-minute video. I know they all, I always try to, like, make them shorter, and then it ends up running longer. So we'll keep this one nice and concise, actually. Uh, I guess I'm just kind of being a baby about taking the tape off here. But these only have one card in them, so I want to make sure that I'm not going to hurt them. And, um, yeah, let me know down in the comments. Have you guys uh, gotten the Nagaba collection box at all? Have you ordered any of the uh, promo packs? Maybe you're checking out the single card listings on eBay. Let me know if this is uh, something you had your eyes on or even knew about. Um, I, I try not to order... The Japanese stuff 
whenever I can because it's just a hassle. You're paying a premium for someone else to import it, and if you do it, that also takes a long time, and uh, you're going to pay more in shipping. It'll still be less, but you'll get it way later because you're not buying in bulk like these companies are. So these are really cool. Um, I'm almost tempted to keep one sealed just to say I have one sealed, but uh, <clears throat> I don't know. Maybe I will. Maybe I'll keep one sealed, and then um, and then uh, what was I gonna say? Maybe I'll keep one sealed and then I'll buy the rest, you know, as singles. We'll see, we'll see. If I don't get a if I don't get like an Umbreon or an Espeon or an EV, then maybe I'll open all of them. I don't know. I'm so indecisive. All right, here we go. Uh, first pack, or maybe I can just get a clean opening save the pack without really you know oh my god <laughs> you hear Soraya yelling in the background she's playing the okay I don't know if there's any way to open this without splitting it because the pack's just not maybe maybe I'm not even going to waste you guys time one sec okay no there's there's like no way to like split this like perfectly so there we go. There goes the corner. I did it. Oh my god, they won't open. Oh my goodness. I'm going to I'm going to do it. I'm going to cut it. I don't like doing this, but some of the uh I don't know, they just they don't rip open like nicely at all. <laughs> it's so resilient. I don't understand. I don't understand how that happens. Oh, look at that. We got we got a uh Vaporeon. I'm really trying not to like oh, damage the card in any way. Look at that. It's so pretty. Oh my goodness. Well, here goes the look at the look at the cut though. I mean the the centering's amazing. You know, I, I now that I'm looking at this, you can tell the border blends. So it makes it makes it harder to tell if there's a messed up border. Uh, I don't know, I just realized that. It is a little bit thicker on the right side, but it's you know it's a promo and it, it's hollow and love the simplistic uh Nagaba drawing art. Okay, let's see if I can get a better opening. No, they're all going to be like this. They're all going to be where I only get the corner. Uh, that's nerve-wracking. I hate opening them like that. Okay, this one's, this one's a little bit better. All right, what are we thinking here? Oh, we got a Leafeon. All right. There is our Leafeon. These cards have a tiny bit of a natural bend to them, but overall, about the same cut as the other one, so... There's our Leafeon, and there's our Vaporeon. It'd be cool to get uh, an Umbreon here, or an Espeon. Okay, this is just... I don't like how it does that. Oh, okay. I should have I should have been doing that. Stupid. All right, here we go. Ooh, all right, Jolteon. Here, here's the thing: we're not getting duplicates. It, you know, I'll open the fourth pack. Why not? We just don't want to get a duplicate. Here, we'll we'll take a look at them in a second here. All right, final one. Fingers crossed for an Umbreon or an Espeon here, or Flareon. It'd be kind of cool to get the Flareon, but honestly, you know. Okay. Oh, this might be a good pack that I can kind of like. Just kind of like retape back up, and I can make it. I don't know. <laughs> just so I can have it for display. All right, here we go. <gasps> oh, we got the EV. Yes. Look at that. It's such a simplistic card. The cut on this one's even better than the other ones. <sighs> that makes me so happy. All right, we're going to sleeve these bad boys. But we got we got three of the originals out of the four. You know, like the original four. Like, you don't... 
include the evolutions or uh, if you only include the, uh, never mind, the original four. You know what I'm saying. Okay, we're going to sleeve these bad boys up. These bad boys and girls, you never know. It'd be funny if they started doing the genders on the cards, but I mean, that'd be totally unnecessary. There'd be no point in that. Okay, so there we go. No duplicates with my four packs, so that is awesome. Really happy about that. We have Leafy on. I wish I could get any closer here, but I don't think it'll really. It's not going to want to do it. We've got the Leafy on. Jolteon. Vaporeon. And the Eevee. So all in all, um, not bad. I'm going to end up getting the other uh, five evolutions to complete the set. And then I'm uh, not sure what I'll do with them at that point, but it will be probably nine of them, right? There's nine of them. Three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. Yeah, there's nine of them. So that's a full binder page. Uh, it could be really cool. Maybe a top loader binder. I, I still need to work on that. But um, yeah, really sick. Really cool promo set. Uh, I know they they disappeared within like a couple days of being on the Pokemon Center, uh, like being up. So that sucks. I, I hope that people can get some. Um, but you already know the resellers and the eBay, you know, shops, like it's going to be hard to get your hands on these, unfortunately. So do it sooner rather than later. If it's something that you're interested in, um, because I just don't see these lasting forever, like supply wise. Um, and that's, that's a little unfortunate, but I don't know. What can you do? It's just such a high demand item that it was pretty much guaranteed to happen like this, like all the other hyped products do. Um, and yeah, so I don't know, just wanted to share that this was something cool that I got. I guess I could have used this one on the bottom. Um, and I uh, just wanted to, you know, use it as an excuse to check in on you guys and see if uh, you guys were getting anything cool. But yeah, that is the Yu Nagaba uh, Pokemon card game collab. Um, I guess, let's see. We're at 13 minutes, real quick. Um, post editing Jakey coming in here. I accidentally muted my mic. Um, so, this will be the end of the video. Thank you guys for watching. Um, let me know if you're interested in this uh, promotional set. Let me know if you got anything cool coming in um, or what you're interested in at the time being. But that's, uh, that's it. Thanks for watching the video. Appreciate it. Bye-bye. Hope you guys have a good night. Okay. Catch you in the next one. Wee.